riding a bike requires a remarkable level of coordination. It's a complex skill that we almost all learn, but that Danny McGaskill has taken to the extreme. Riding a bike to me just feels completely natural, as if I'm on my feet. And he shows just how automated a little pedaling can become. Danny has learned to control his body with effortless precision. Every second requires exquisite balance, fast reaction times, coordination and speed, integrating together to allow Danny to unconsciously coordinate his body and bike through space and time. It's kind of similar to running over rocks on a beach. You just know exactly how far you need to shift your feet to get to each rock. It's the same for me when I ride my bike. I know exactly how much pressure to put on my pedals. It's almost easier for me to do it on my bike than it is on my feet. Only now have we been able to fully understand how this is made possible. Through the intricate way our vestibular system, sense of balance and proprioception work together. And yet we all use these systems every day. Every move you make, even just walking down the street, requires a complexity that even the most advanced robot on Earth cannot match. Every second, tens of thousands of touch receptors in your hands are feeding back information to your brain. Along with balance data from the vestibular system in the inner ears and your eyes. All this information is collated by the central nervous system and used to compute your exact body position. Danny's brain can then make tiny adjustments to hundreds of muscles all over his body to ensure he stays in control. 